How's it going, bestie viewers? Anyone can get sick regardless of their age. Doctors have developed cures for almost everything, but what about the effectiveness of traditional methods? Have you ever heard of acupressure? It's a Chinese therapy that can help cure several conditions without popping pills. In today's video, we'll focus on a few pressure points that can heal your body and mind naturally. Do you know all the benefits of Feng Shi? What about Zhu Li? We'll talk about all of this and more. The concept of traditional Chinese medicine dates back to around 600 BC. According to its philosophy, changes in nature can affect a person's mental, emotional, physical, and spiritual well-being. Acupressure is a safe and mild form of traditional Chinese medicine used to treat a variety of disorders. You simply have to apply pressure to certain points of your body using your thumbs, fingers, and sometimes elbow. We'll focus on unique pressure points that can be practiced conveniently. Let's see how pressing the Kui Hao Shu point can benefit your health. Is your back hurting? Have no fear. This massage method will get rid of all of that. If you're looking for a natural way to deal with lower back discomfort or irregular menstruation, this acupressure point is the best one for you. It can also help you cure dysmenorrhea or asthma. So how do you find a pressure point? Well, it's actually pretty easy. This point is located two finger widths above your hip. All you have to do is stand up and put both your hands around your waist. Make sure your thumbs are wrapping over your back. Make a circular motion with your thumbs. Massage both sides of your spine for four to five seconds using your thumbs. Don't forget to create firm pressure. Return to the starting point and repeat two more times. Do this regularly to get 100% relief. If you're experiencing stress and anxiety, you should try the Ying Tang acupressure. This involves massaging a point between your eyebrows. Hindu culture considers this pressure point to be in the location of your third eye. It's supposed to stabilize your outlook. Research has found this pressure point to cure cardiovascular symptoms. Start by gently pressing this point with your fingertips for a minute, then releasing it. It's something you can do a couple times a week. Massaging this point is also recommended for relieving migraines, anxiety, eye strain, stress, and insomnia. It can also help treat nasal congestion and boost cognitive performance. That's not all. Massaging the Hiju point can help heal issues with the face or head. Recognized as the body's pain point, Hiju is a highly common acupressure point. It can be used to treat any disorder that affects your face or head. It comes quite handy in the flu season. This point is located deep between your index finger and thumb's web. Start by massaging the region with your thumb. Keep the pressure soft. Continue this for about a minute, then rest for another minute before repeating. Hiju or Hand Valley Point can effectively help cure headaches, neck discomfort, face pain, and toothaches. Just know that if you're pregnant, you should avoid massaging this point as it can induce labor. Want to know more? Here's how massaging the Nuguan can help. The Nuguan, or P6, is an acupressure point inside your arm near the wrist. If you're struggling with chemotherapy or pregnancy-related nausea and vomiting, you should give this point a try. To locate it, you can measure three finger widths below your wrist at the base of your palm. Just below your fingers, place your thumb on this point and gently push your forearm until you feel two big tendons. Apply a little pressure to this area. Continue to massage for four to five seconds while maintaining mild pressure. Don't forget to repeat with the other wrist. This is a must-try acupressure point, as it can also help you deal with an upset stomach, motion sickness, carpal tunnel syndrome, and headaches. If you don't want to pop pills to deal with your headaches, go to the Zongzu pressure point. SJ3, or Zongzu, is an acupressure point commonly used to cure headaches, puffy eyes, and shoulder discomfort. To identify this point accurately, find the tendons between your pinky and ring finger. 
Press the point twice a day to heal your throat disorders or joint pain. You can see the results by massaging the point with strong pressure for one to three minutes. If you feel dizzy often, this acupressure point will be miraculous for you. Oh, and yes, you can do it on both hands. So what are other acupressure points that can improve your overall health? Do you know about the Zhang Jing? If you're having headaches, neck pain, and shoulder tightness, research has proven that massaging the Zhang Jing can help. Also known as the shoulder well, this point is located midway between your shoulder point and the base of your neck, near the border of your shoulder. It can be located by pressing your thumb and middle finger on your shoulder muscle. To take advantage of this pressure point, apply hard, circular pressure on the spot with your thumb for about a minute. To put it plainly, the Lao Gong acupressure point can help you cure several health issues naturally. Lao Gong is one of the most powerful acupressure points. It heals multiple problems like removing extra heat from your body, mouth ulcers, anxiety, and nosebleeds. It's the point that balances the fire element in your body. To find this point, first make a fist. The position where the tip of your ring finger rests to your palm is the right location of the Lao Gong. Massaging this point can also help you increase your internal energy and cure a fever. Press the point with firm pressure for two to three seconds. The ideal time to do this is from seven to 9 p.m. The Lao Gong is at its finest during these hours. Massage this acupoint to reduce weariness and rejuvenate the mind. You'd be surprised to know that massaging the Tai Chong acupoint can ease menstrual cramps and other illnesses. If you have painful periods, we've got a natural solution for you. Located on your foot, the Tao Chong acupoints can be found two finger widths above the position where your big toe and index toe meet. If you're suffering from stress, lower back pain, post-stroke depression, menstrual cramps, or sleepiness, this point can be miraculous for you. Research also proves that this acupoint can reduce blood pressure in individuals with hypertension. If you're facing digestive difficulties, eye problems, vaginal discomfort, or irritability, this pressure point can be the ultimate solution for you. Massage and stimulate this point with firm pressure for two to three seconds, and remember to repeat on both feet. Interesting, right? Here's more. The Shaosan Li Acupoint helps to heal everyday health issues. Nobody likes getting diarrhea, and a case of bad diarrhea can ruin your entire day. If it's becoming a real issue, try massaging this pressure point. Research states that Shao San Li is also beneficial for healing neck shoulder arm dysfunction. To find this point accurately, bend your elbow at 90 degrees and measure three finger widths below your elbow crease on the outer surface of your forearm. Massage and stimulate the acupoint with strong pressure for four to five seconds. If you do it properly, your trips to the bathroom are about to get a lot more relaxing. Believe it or not, you can treat several health hazards by trying the Zhuzhan Li Acupoint. Also known as the point of longevity, Zhuzhan Li is a pressure point located below your kneecap. This 100 disease point can help you heal a variety of health conditions. Research states that this pressure point can help people manage asthma, asthma-related inflammation, and gastrointestinal issues. Also, you'll be happy to know that older people who massage this acupoint showed decreased levels of depression, anxiety, and stress. It's also known to have a positive effect on your brain function. Quite a win-win, isn't it? You can find the Zushan Li point by sitting comfortably. It's located on the outer side of your leg, around four finger widths below your kneecap. Apply firm pressure in a downward direction for about four to five seconds. Slowly massage in a clockwise direction. Don't forget to focus on both legs. You can massage this point as frequently as you like. To get the best results, massage this spot right before going to bed. Do it daily and watch your health improve. We're not done yet. The Feng Shui AccuPoint can do wonders for your headaches and migraines. Everyone dreads the flu season. I mean, getting the flu can ruin your week and sometimes seriously damage your health. This is where Feng Shi comes in. 
Low energy, blurry eyes, tiredness, and headaches are frequently treated by pressing on the Feng Shi point. If you slept in a bad posture last night, you can calm your stiff neck by stimulating this pressure point. You can easily locate it behind your ear bone. Just follow the groove to the top of your neck and base of your skull. For an easy massage, interlock your fingers to clasp your hands. Then push firmly against this point with your thumb. Continue to massage for 5 seconds and get the best results. You should visit your doctor if these points don't relieve your discomfort after 2-3 to three weeks. It could be an indication of something much worse. It's better to be sure. Let's keep the conversation going with a couple more videos, shall we? Check out our video on 5 home remedies for natural colon cleansing. Or how about the 8 foods that improve your nervous system? Go ahead, click one, or better yet, watch both and learn natural ways to cure common health problems. Have you tried massaging any of these points? Let us know in the comments below.